Hey Cajon Drummers, welcome back to Cajon Groove Guide. Today we're going to break down another famous drum groove on the Cajon. So that's the famous drum break on Funky Drummer by James Brown. The drummer was Clyde Stubblefield and because of that little 20 second drum break that he recorded, he really influenced hip-hop music a great deal. It became the most sampled piece of drumming, I think, in the history of that genre. Sadly, you might have seen in the news he actually just died last Saturday. On a more positive note though, isn't it amazing that decades and decades after that recording, we're still using that little piece of drumming, we're still keeping that drum break alive. So let's do our best and try to learn this super influential snippet of music. First up, let's have a listen to that groove at a slow tempo. Just slowing down the tempo is of course not the only way that we can learn a new cajon groove. Sometimes it's best to split it in half. In this case we could do the first two beats, the next two beats, and then pop, put it all back together. Okay, let's see if we can bring up the tempo now. Something that we should keep in mind as we learn this is that we're taking a groove that has hi-hat, snare drum, bass drum, open hi-hat, all of these various different sounds, and then we're bringing them across to the cajon. So instead of having right hand, left hand, right foot, we have to really handle everything with just right hand and left hand. Plus, that contrast between those light and heavy sounds is how we make this little box sound like three or four different drums all in one place. So I'll show you how it sounds when we don't pay too much attention to the, the dynamics, the contrast, right? The distance between our light and our heavy hits. And I think that pretty much covers this drum groove. So thank you very much for joining me once again. If you're keen to keep your practice session going, I'll put some links up on the screen now for some playlists, some other things on my channel that you can check out. So if you have any questions or thoughts, don't forget to let me know down in that comment section below this video. If you enjoyed it, please give it a like. I will see you guys next time. Bye.